Hi guys, it's Noreen O'Connor here. I'm here today to show you how to create this multicolored marble effect that has some gold veining going through it. Be sure to subscribe to my channel. I post new videos every Tuesday and hit that little bell button to make sure you get notifications on all my new videos. Using the lid of my Yours Halo Stamper, I'm going to apply some C and D shellac in Wisteria Haze, Salmon Run, Viridian Veil and Blackpool. Set this to one side. Starting with a shellac manicure that already has two coats of Creekside applied, I'm now placing random stripes of the previous dots of shellac onto the nail. The trick to this pattern is to not think about it too much. I like my stripes to pretty much go in the same direction and when I pat it with alcohol I try not to think too much about the effect I'm trying to achieve. I just place a nice generous amount of IPA onto the nail and allow the colour to spread sporadically. This random pattern makes for the best effect. Allow the IPA to dry slightly and if not happy, repeat the steps to create the look that you want. Cure in your chosen C and D lamp. Once cured, I'm now going to outline some of the colours in Blackpool. By creating a barrier between the individual colours, I think it shows up this effect far more effectively. Again, try not to think about what you're doing too much. Just a quick swipe here and there is going to produce the best effect. As before, you're going to blend this out with a little bit of alcohol. So dip your brush into it and just pat over it. I've used a Lacente D2 brush for all of this work. The beauty of doing your marbling this way is that you can go back in and add a little bit more or take a little bit away as you need it. Once happy, cure this in your LED lamp. I'm now going to apply a thin layer of Lucente Layer It over the entire nail. I'm doing this because I want to create a tack free surface and you'll see why in a minute. Cure that on the 3 setting in your LED lamp. To add the gold veining, I'm now going to go over some of the areas of the black pool and add in a little bit more. What this will do is it will create a sticky layer for the gold foil to adhere to, while the rest of the shellac will remain untouched. This is the easiest way to produce gold foiling. Using Lacente Gold Foil, shiny side up, I'm now pressing it into the nail and you can see it only sticks to where we put that black pool. Next I'm going to apply C&D Shellac Matte Top Coat to the nail and using the C&D 5 point polish method I'm going to apply a nice thin even coat all over. I always think marbleized designs look best with a matte finish and because this nail has some gold foiling going through it I think the matte really shows it off as well. Once it's cured on your LED lamp you're going to now remove the sticky top film with some IPA or Disperse and allow to dry. I love how these nails came out. The marble always looks so effective when it's matte and that metallic gold foil veining going through it really finishes it off. Hope you liked it guys. Stay tuned for my next video. See you then.